Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Bowie. I'm Matthew. And I'm a deal. So, we uh, cleared off the rest of the cycling road and now we're heading on the way to Saffron City. On the road to Saffron City. It's not as good of a song, you know. But, nah. um, let's kind of see what's going on here. Oh, that was fast. Oh yeah, it's, um, yeah, it was a long trek, you know. Um, what does it say? Trainer tips. New Great Ball offers improved capture rates. Try it on those hard to catch Pokemans. You know, I like That's what my grandma calls them. I, I like some I like some great balls. At least to be determined. Ooh. So uh, there's there's plenty to do here. There's a Pokemon Center down here, which I'm gonna <coughs> enter um, so that um, we can heal our Pokemon who already max hell. Yeah, boy. I wanna go ahead and heal them anyways, because I don't um because we got the HM Fly, which allows us to teleport to essentially any a Pokemon Center we stayed at. Um, but we have to have a um, flying Pokemon. Yeah, but I'm just like doing this now just so it's um, we have it available. Um, hmm. So, now we see Team Rocket is all over the place here. With Sylph under control, we can exploit Pokemon around the world! Wait, Sylph is under control? By Team Rocket? Now, this guy... Oh, this is Mr. Sykes' house. I wonder what he's gonna do for us. Tell us the future? Hey, look, he's gonna- wait, don't say a word. You're one of this. So he gives us the TM for Psychic, which is a, one of the best moves in the game. Don't do it. One of the best moves in the game. So, um, let's, let's use it on someone. I can't use it on any Pokemon on my team. This is GARBAGE! You know, if I was smart, I'd sell it. But he just wants me to die. So I'll just sell it. Good. Just so that, um, Dill doesn't have an aneurysm. He's gonna get right in front of the cashier and be like, Oops! <laughs> <laughs> I dropped it! That would've been a great idea. So this is the Sylph Company building, which was, um, kind of blocked off before, but now it's not anymore. So we can go in there now. But I have other plans first. Uh, before we, you know, Sylph it out. To so, talk to this dude? Yeah. Being evil makes me feel so alive! So it's like, they, they know they're the bad guys. Good on you, dude. Oh, I already read this sign. New Great Ball offers! Yeah, because remember how I told you you had Great Balls? Oh. Thanks, Phil. You would know. Wait a minute, no! So this guy is like, Saffron belongs to Team Rocket. So, there's a, a family inside this house that can't get out because of this guy, so... Um, but you know, we don't... I don't personally get... Oh, is it this house? Oh, I'm so confused. I think it's that house. What do you want? Get lost. There's... So many, um, you know, Team Rocket members, but, you know, I don't really care. This doesn't really affect me. Boss said he'll take this town. So, you know, I'll just, uh, head to the, to the gym. <clears throat> Which gym? The gym or the gym gym? <laughs> the gym or the gym gym? So, the gym, um... If it was owned by Jim, it'd be Jim's gym gym. Okay, now that's just confusing. So, the gym gym is actually the gym of this town. So, um, the... The one that just says Jim is the fighting dojo. You which know, is our first stop today, so... Um, then I think I'll make my way down the second part of the town, but... Um, Sabrina, Master Psychotype Pokemon. So, even if I didn't care about, you know, taking getting rid of Team Rocket, you know... I, I need that gym badge, so I gotta take him down. But yeah. first, I'm gonna show off the fighting dojo. So, um... It's just pretty... It's pretty simple. It's kind of like... It's pretty much, uh, oh, this sort of gauntlet of trainers, so... That's a terrible idea. I... I if I can one-shot him, it's fine. You're trespassing, you're fighting, Dojo! I think they all have, like, one Pokemon each or something? Something like that. Some kind of shit, isn't it? No, never mind. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> Immediately wrong. Oh, well. This guy's just got a Machap. A Machap. And, uh, Strength can just take care of this. Like, a uh, Taurus is just strong enough, it can really just plow through this. It isn't... Tars just vroom vrooms. Yeah, he vroom vrooms through this. I can't breathe. Oh, uh, you looking at my cat? I think so. We're gonna find out. <laughs> oh. Then we're gonna die. I love cats, and they're like, eat it. They're like, eat it, nerd. Yeah, boy. What are they going to eat? Jeez, family friendly content. That's <laughs> what they're going to eat. Beautiful. That's exactly what I like to hear. <laughs> eat this family friendly content. Oh, wow, they didn't... go. Oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Good thing he wasted his turn. <laughs> yeah, good thing. 
if that guy had done done, done the <coughs> submission on me, I'd be out of here. You'd be you'd be stupid. You would have to submit. Yeah. Oof! He gives up. It's like a trainer. I know I, what this guy has. I hear you're good. Show me. Show me. I hear you're good. I literally just saw you beat my friends. Yeah, but this guy's better. You get He's done with the fight. Top. You get done with the fight. He's like, hey Jim. He's good. You take one step. I hear you're good. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jim. You know, like it's just even even fair. You know, if, if if Jim was a Pokemon type, it would be Jim's Jim Jim Jim. Wow. Wow. Jim type. Jim type. Jim 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 Jim. What That's would, beautiful, Dill. What would a Jim type be? Um, isn't there an Office character named Jim? I've never seen The Office. People make fun of me for I that. I think so. I think The Office is just a rip-off of Parks and Rec. Don't look at the chronology of the two, because Parks and Rec came second. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. All I'm saying... Yeah, you know, just... Oh, it's a, it's a rip and I'm sticking to it. You're gonna want to switch. Immediately, you're gonna want to switch. Why? Because the last primate was level 31. This one's level 36. Hey, Dill, watch this. You're gonna go for the flinch. Critical hit. I don't believe. Whee. Yeah, you're right. Critical well, a, hit. But well, that's a normal type move. It's, yeah, it's gonna critical hit, but. <laughs> but who gives a care? Yeah. Oh man. Dude, it would have been so hype if I had called that. If I had called the crit, I would have been impressed. <laughs> Stop uh, fingers, my fi my fingers, my fingers. Yeah, how do you like that? I say that trying to be funny at Chili's. I'll be like, "Ow!" At the, like the plate's hot. "Ow!" I'm like, "Kyle, I burnt my fingers." <laughs> trying to be funny, and everybody just looks at me like I'm stupid. And I'm like, "Okay, guys." Don't 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 laugh too hard. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Last time I try and crack a joke around this place. Poor Dylan's fingies. And then Kyle walks around the corner. Man, dick joke. Everyone laughs. Like, oh. <laughs> I'm glad no one laughs at your fingies, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Breedis can do this. Just ice beam. Ice beam. Ice beam. Why would I do that when I have surf? Ice beam. Why do you want me to use ice beam? I don't know. Like surf is more powerful. I mean, yeah. Is it? What? I mean, you got a crit. So look at that. You are. What? Right. Well, wait. What damage is um, ice beam? Is, is it eighty-five or ninety-five? I 95? don't know. You get stab. Is surf is no surf you, is better you, than ice you beam. Get stab sure. on both of them. Yeah, but like still, like I think surf is naturally more powerful. Is it? I know it is in later generations. Because they buff it. I think. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Uh, Surf is already powerful. Surf is like 95, I believe. I used Ice Beam, by the way. How did it do? Oh. Exact same. We'll never know the difference. Yeah, boy. In Gen 1, Surf is a power 90 move. Okay. So now, Bill, um, yeah. we know it's time for the real thing. We can talk about. I mean, the one you talk about comes first. So now, Grunt! I am the Karate Master! I am the leader here! You wish to challenge us? Expect no mercy! Fwah! So actually, uh, this place, um, I think <coughs> it actually used to be the gym of Saffron City, but when the Sabrina came in with their psychic types, they just, like, completely knocked these guys out of their gym status. So... She just, like... She kind of usurped it. Nerd. Yeah, pretty much. So he sends out Hitmonlee first. So, um, that's... A Pokemon I want to talk about. So essentially, it's a high attack, you know, a decent speed Pokemon, and is essentially just a faster, less powerful Machamp. Um, that's really what it ends up being. I think it has pretty decent defense, so I'm not sure how this is going to turn out for me, but I'll try to stomp the flinch it. <sighs> Did it work? No. Oh, okay, this is going to. I'm going to get dunked on. Not really. You be I. Okay, yeah, that's better than I thought. Just barely I, but you I. Um, but it's got um. Its main th uh, main draw is that it has this move, High Jump Kick, which is an extremely, it's the most powerful fighting type move in the game. 
However, it's very inaccurate and, well, it's not very inaccurate, but it's, if it misses, you do damage to yourself instead. So it has this, you know, uh, risk reward play style, mm. so that's really the draw of it, but it can learn strength, but I can recommend it for the main game for sure, but less so for the meta. But his next Pokemon is... His second Pokemon is my favorite fighting type Pokemon. Which means it's the worst. Which means it's actually, literally, the worst fighting type Pokemon <laughs> In the game. It, in a game where fighting the, type's not that strong. In the... It's actually the worst fighting type in the entirety of Pokemon. At least until Gen 3. And, no, at least through Gen 3. Because you're like, oh, Hitmonchan, that's cool. You get options. You can use Thunder Punch. Fire Punch. You can use Fire Punch. You can use Ice Punch. Look at those options. Look at that variety. Look at that. And then you're like, on the special stat. Then you're like, look at Hitmonchan's special stat. And you're like, oh. It's actually useless. So yeah. I think the only move you get to use any kind of good is uh is, is Mega Punch. Um Do you even learn fighting type moves? I think you learn some, but you don't learn any of the kicking ones. Um it, you have to see the th the thing is is he has the ability to freeze, he has the ability to paralyze, and he has the ability to burn. But it really doesn't mean anything because he gets no damage with those moves, um, and he doesn't have the special sight to utilize his gimmick. And Hitmonlee is the better defender of the two. Yeah, um, it, but it it can only really effectively use fighting and normal type moves. But it doesn't learn the best of either of those. So he's Garbo. <laughs> yeah, um, but. It makes me a little sad because this Pokemon actually has so much potential. Like, if, yep. if this, he could have been the most interesting Pokemon, like, fighting type Pokemon in this game if instead of a, an attack, like, having high attack, he had high special. That would have been crazy cool. Mm -hmm. And then he'd be pretty useful, actually. So, it, he, it makes me a little sad. He can learn strength, though, if you want to use him. I do not recommend him in this game. I, I As much as I love him, neither can I. I tried, and then you get him, and you're just like, wow. Indeed, I have lost. But I beseech thee, do not take our emblem as your trophy. In return, I will give you a prize fighting Pokemon. Choose whichever one you like. So I could choose Hitmon uh, Chan or Hitmon Lee. But uh, I have I have a full team as it is, so fuck them. <laughs> He's just like, nah. <laughs> y'all 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 bitches weak. <laughs> uh, using a fighting type in this metagame? <laughs> <laughs> Lol. So now that that's done, um what? That's over here. Oh, there's the mark. Um yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and sell Psychic. Uh oh, Scadios. And, um, sell Psychic. Who would you like to sell? My bicycle. I'll be a million monies. Uh, I think, yeah, that's definitely Psychic. Um. Yeah. To <laughs> sell so all the Pokeballs? Yeah, I have a plan. Oh, I know what your plan is. Sell one of them. Fake us out. Now I could buy a great ball to replace them. You only sold one Pokeball. Really? Yeah, you, you messed up. You went one too far. <sighs> Boy. Boy. Um. See? Damn it. I tried to sell the bicycle and then it kicked try me Try again. Yep, yeah, there we go. Yeah, there you go. Look at that. And bye. This is slow menuing. Uh, what else is there in here? Oh, I can buy revives and full heals. Full, I can get rid of other shit and buy full heals instead. Just buy full heals, you don't need great balls. I know your strat. I found out your plan. What's my plan? I know your plan. Oh. Don't buy great balls, they're useless. It's a waste of money. Yeah, you're right. You don't need them. Not yet. Well, we're going, we don't need pokeballs. Okay, uh... But you should, buy, you should buy full heals just for the ability to cure your poison. Yeah, well, I, I want to clear our in inventory space, so I'm going to sell everything else I got. I want to keep that. So good. So now I don't have to worry about having anything other than... Oh, Jesus. Now just buy 99 of them. No, I don't want Great Balls. I already have those. Um, Let's see. About like 48. Uh, Really? 25 should do for like the majority of the game. 15,000 monies? Yeah. Wow. Well, that's $150, really, is because it's based off a of yen. So. Yerp. <laughs> uh, yay, exchange rates! Isn't Pokemon fun? 
<laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Well, now that that's done, uh, let's go ahead and enter the Silk Building and you know take care of Team Rocket here because go beat them up. They're uh, <clears throat> running my Pokemon time. Look at this fountain. Look at this. Look at that. And there's no one here to greet us. What a horrible what a, company. How terrible. Just leave. Never yeah, come man. back. You know, just awful service. There's no greeter. This Silk Company. Team Rocket. Uh, zero out of ten. Um, zero of ten on Yelp. Oh boy. So essentially, uh, I'm gonna. There's a checkpoint in here where I think we're gonna, um, where I'm gonna be like, okay, after oh this, my God. oh jeez, there's a checkpoint here where after this I'm gonna be like, okay, we're just gonna cut off the rest of these fights, um, because they're just unnecessary at this point. You'll thank us. Um, because this is a really long building, um, really, I think that the entire section, once you finish Lavender Town, just going through, there's a lot of padding in the routes from Lavender, um, Lavender Town back up to when you go to... Sabrina. If you couldn't tell in our last two episodes. Yeah, like, it's it's kind of like, oh, there's a lot of here, there's a lot of not new Pokemon, and it's just kind of like, with just a really high trainer density that are just all optional, it's just, they're really just gr a bunch of grind routes. Hey, look, that Thunderbolt coming in strong. Yeah. It's almost worth it. It's not. <laughs> I assure you it's not, but they'll be fine. So this guy started out with Golbat. His last four Pokemon are Zubat, Zubat, Raticate, Zubat. So he really just started off strong and was like, well, <laughs> should have thought better about that plan. I mean, if you can't do it with your best Pokemon first, I mean, what? <laughs> he, I think he was just hoping for a sweep. He was like, come on, Zubat can't do anything, neither can Zubat. And you know, Zubat also is really weak. And Raticate is Raticate. Raticate's getting stomped. Just stomp him. Just like, Raticate's head being crushed by just <gasps> like, hoof. Oh boy, Crimson Helm, I love you. We're level 37. I wish I could look at those stats. And just say how busted this Pokemon oh, is. I think, I think, um, when we get to the end of the game, yeah. right before we fight the Pokemon League, I think I'm gonna, like, take a final look at everyone's stats. I think that'd be a cool thing to do. Yeah. Beep. Actually, we're gonna... Because once you finish, like, it just... There's just, I really do think there's a lot of padding in like the Fuchsia City arc of this game. You but once you get past it, everything else just comes so much more quickly. So, this is the last big dungeon. So essentially, I'm going to be climbing up the stairs um, a lot until I reach the certain floor um, where things actually are. So, within there, there's some, there's an there's some, there are some interesting NPCs. Um... One of them being, some of them being, like, there's the uh, Rocket Brothers that are here. The Rocket Bros. Yeah. Burning up their fuse up there alone. Oh, boy. Dude, I keep on forgetting to switch out to Abritus in front. Ah, oh, well, you can just, you just, you just mess them up. Yeah, boy. It's a Machop. Level 29 Machop. He never even tried. Yeah. Um, I think... The Pokemon was actively like, hey, boss, I can get stronger. And this Grunt's like, no! Can't be stronger than me. <laughs> <laughs> then the Machamp punches it in the gut, and then <laughs> he's like, "Oh, you are, you are, oh, oh. boy! Oh. What a loser!" Who the hell texted me? I don't know. I didn't text you. I know that. Boy, we defeated R Rocketo, Rocketo. But yeah. Um, so it's pretty much just the same old, same old. It's a bunch of gold bats and... Really? Well, I tell you, look, starting from the top floor down, because it's all the same. Uh, hold on, hold on. We're at the good stuff now. we at the good stuff. Oh, shoot. actually, I'll fight a scientist, because uh, we haven't fought a scientist before. They have metal Pokemon. They usually have Magnemite and Electro... Um, Magnemite line and Voltorb line. Mixed in with Goonjo. I mean, and they with actually Goonger. will have uh, some of them have Porygon, which is actually an interesting Pokemon to ship. Here? I know some of them do. I don't know if in, in uh if there's one in this building or not. I don't think any of them here do. Well, Stomp didn't one shot the Magneton. Well, I guess it has high defense. My girlfriend's the worst at name of Pokemon. <laughs> I'm I sorry, babe, but you don't watch these episodes. <laughs> the worst at naming Pokemon? She caught a Buneary. And named it, named it, Bunny Bum. <laughs> <laughs> I'm making fun of you, babe. You don't even know. 
I said, do you love him? And she says, I named him Bunny Bum. <laughs> that poor Boneri. I'm not a bum. I'm not a hard-working I'm not a bum. I work hard for this. I work hard for that experience. Oh, they also use some poison types. That's yeah. interesting. From what I see, they have either wheezing or muck. One of the two. Yeah, boy, because they're wheezing. Or a caffin. Uh, why are you putting on my mudkip hat? Because I like mudkip. I heard you like mudkips. Because I'm a meme lord, you know? Yeah, boy. <sighs> Yeah, this I, is this is this is the game. I mean, honestly, that's that's one. I think this one ends up being like just one of the worst sections of Gen One, just because there's all there's no new Pokemon for a good while. Um, but right after this, then you know it act the game picks up again. You have some really really cool things actually available to you. So um, it's like they had to get to level forty ish, level forty five ish before you, they give you the really good shit. Yeah, but now here's. Um, Here's one of the most important things. So you go and you step on this tile, and you're like, oh boy, I'm over here. I wonder where I am, and you're eight floors up. Then you go here. Yeah, you just step on it again. Then I heard there's a kid wandering around here. News travels fast. Some dude just yelled down the hallway, Hey! That's a kid! <laughs> that kid beat the shit out of me! You guys should probably use more than Zubat! And they're like, like, what? I didn't hear that last part. And this guy's, well, this guy's packing a Nardbox. Which would actually, in a later generation, would be dangerous because of... And this generation is dangerous because eat that. Okay, can I... I... Oh, too bad he sucks. Oh, no. Too bad I suck. Too, too bad, bad he sucks. sucks. <laughs> Beautiful. That dude had a golden opportunity. I was like, oh, uh, I didn't think I'd get this far. Uh, now, now this is, the, this is the best part of this, right? I get the card key. So this is the quickest way to get to the card key. It's just to uh, go to this floor, hit this teleporter, get out of here. So what the card key can do, I'll show it off here, is that, oh, look at this. Any of these doors, you can open with the card key. Bingo! So there's a lot of really, really good items in here that you can get. Like uh, this boil right here. I got a couple nuggets. TM09. Self-destruct. Is that self-destruct? I looked it up. So TM09 is self-destruct. Teach a Pokemon to blow himself up. Oh, never mind. Oh, well, Dolan can't read. Self-destruct is somewhere in this bit. Yeah, I know. Um, Self-destruct is going on my cloister. Oh, my God. Just think about that for a second. You're like, hey, cloister, I got I got some news for you. you We're going to expand that repertoire. And he's like, oh, boy, I wonder what master is going to teach me to help me fight. Die. <laughs> he just read. He just opened it. He just, like, put the TM in the computer for him to watch. And it's like, blow yourself up. The end. And Cloyster's like, ooh boy. Oh, I got this protein. This protein. Here, I'll uh, put a Breedus in front now. Get Just... that muscle milk. What? Because Tauros is a cow. Oh, uh, I get it. Except not really. Um, now there's another floor. I don't know what floor I'm on. I think... I think you're on two. No. Because this goes down. So that was, I think it's That's three. three. No. Four. Five. Okay, this is the first floor, yeah. so I think I want to go to the third floor now. One, two, three. Now, I know. Um, I have no idea what floor we're on. I can't count. Yeah, yeah, this is it. This is it. This the one. So, pretty much, I gotta fight this guy. <laughs> so quit messing with this kid. <laughs> Dude, you're, I'm about to blow your damn mind, so. What are you gonna do to my mind? Uh, beat up Eradicate, that's what. <laughs> didn't we already do that to Gary and he died? Oh yeah, except it was, it was Eradita, right? It was, didn't have Eradicate yet, did It he? was Eradicate, oh, we wow. murdered it. Yeah, I murdered it. I murked him, Bill. Except Matt Pat was like, no, you didn't really murder him. Oh, really? I think. Oh. And I'm like, you can't prove it, Matt Pat. You can't prove we didn't murder that person to hell and back. To heck and back, Bill. To heck and back. You can't prove I didn't Kratos him and send him back to heck. Pikachu versus Hypno, let's go. Ultimate death match. I think I think you're fine. Especially with a ten level difference. And the ability <laughs> yeah, to we'll punch him with the And the ability stuff. to mega punch. Now let's see this. Dude, I just love Pikachu punching the shit out of Hypno. 
punching the uh, the, 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 the shoe. Oh no, I'm disabled. Oh, <laughs> disabled Thunderbolt. Oh no, I'm disabled. <laughs> and no, I'm not disabled. Oh, well, th what if he disabled your Mega Punch? Then just, I would have Thunderbolted him like Can you this. just like, can you even like, use your arms? Since you can't punch no more? Yeah, but you, I mean, what if you do Karate Chop? <laughs> <laughs> then you'd be able to do that. Like, huh. I'll just chop him instead. It's like, you're disabled, you're just like, oh no! Your hand just shoots out into a karate fist, and you're like, huh. Bob. Ninja, ninja chop. Ninja chop. <laughs> this is... This is Garland's time to shine. Yeah, it is, boy. You just body look slam at, him. Look at, look at that HP. Yeah, I know. I've given him every single HP up I've found. Sweet lord. I mean, that's only like three, but still. It's been, a, it's been like four at this point, I think. I don't know. Hey, loyal viewer who's watched every single episode and has counted the amount of HP ups, how many has it been? <laughs> I don't know. So now, I want to open up this door, and... Bingo, the car key opened the door. Now, I want to go over here. Bingo! Bingo! The car key opened the door. Now, I want to go in here first. I don't Ingo, know. bingo, brother! See, now this is the way to the end of the... Of the oh, Silk yeah. Company. I saw that nerd. Um, so if you want to just go ahead and finish it, go there. So this is actually like the, you know, the pl planned out the quickest route through this place. But if you go over here, I have to fight another rocket, you know. This is, oh, is going to be a little boy. bit longer episode, but oh, it's, boy. Oh, it's worth it to get to this point. Oh, jeez, Rick. I don't know who Rick is. I mean, I don't know who that is either. Probably some shitty ass... Cartoon. People yeah. fan over too much. Yeah, and you know, someone got stabbed apparently. Jesus. Can you imagine, like, if you just had a bunch of geniuses with IQs over 200? And let's say they were, like, arguing over some something stupid, like, I don't know. Uh, some kind of sauce. At a fast food restaurant, even. Like, McDonald's. I know, imagine that. Like, <laughs> like how terrible would that have to be? Yeah. You know, that would just be... That would be... If you have IQs over 200, you're really dropping the ball if someone gets stabbed over McDonald's sauce. I mean, yeah. I mean, because only a real intellectual would probably be able to understand a, a show like that. A true intellectual would understand. It's, it's about Nietzsche and about the Freudian types of life what and you... science. Yeah, there's, like... There's some classic... I'm sure there's like... There's probably like... With all of Great Fun, there's probably some like classic green text. Oh, that is, that is always a classic green text. Or copy paste, I mean. I'm not copy dumb. pasta. Yeah. Copy lasagna. Oh my god. Dude, I could go for some lasagna right now. Some what are you? An orange cat? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh. How'd you I'm know? Funny. I just rip off my human suit. <laughs> oh god, that's why I'm always <gasps> wheezing when I come over here. Cause it's actually you. Oh, well you're always wheezing when I'm I was allergic to you all along. So, now, the other really important thing in here is this room. So this... Is that a bed? Yeah, so you can talk to this lady, and she will, uh, you'll sleep in the bed, and you'll be, he your Pokemon will be healed, so you never have to leave here to go to the Pokemon Center. And so she'll just watch you sleep? We've pretty much, like, we've cleared out a route to go and finish this entire dungeon, so... Now I am going to make my own sacrifice and clear out the rest of the We're going to do that own. for y'all. So we'll do that off camera, and we'll see you guys back here next time for some more Let's Play Pokemon Yellow Vision. Just remember, when you stop here, she watches you sleep. Peace out. Peace. She's watching you right now, fam. Staring at you from the corner. Just because you can't see her don't mean she can't see you.